get your fat, ugly, white face in here. Ah! White Devil! Hey, welcome back to our Stupid Rex Corp. <laughs> <laughs> You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thank well, you, everybody, for us on Patreon. Follow us official Twitter account, subscribe, and hit that like button. Ooh, hit the like button. Oh, yes, yeah, spank it! Guys, hit the like button. <laughs> wow. We must have gotten a secondary high off of that girl behind us. <laughs> you totally. know who you are. Hey, welcome back. Uh, today, we're doing a movie review of a highly anticipated film for, for us, and I, I know a lot of people, because uh, it's been doing the festival circuits for a good while now, including last year. We could have apparently saw it in, I believe it was September, October. It came here for something, and it was in Santa Monica, but then I didn't feel figure out until about the day after, because uh, apparently <laughs> I don't matter. What? <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, but we, we just saw the movie, the new movie, Kill. Not Kill Bill. No. Kill the movie. The Hindi movie. Yeah. Uh, directed by Nikhal Nagesh Bhatt. I don't believe a relation. Correct. Uh, and it comes out uh, in theaters on July 4th. Everywhere. Everywhere, including India. Um, but since this just came out, and we kind of saw it was the um, kind of America premiere, actually. Yeah. yeah. That's a, that's, a, that's a safe way to say that because it's going to get a, a premiere at the uh, Indian Fis Film Festival of Los Angeles. Yeah, and in two days. Um, in two days. And then it gets its, its, its international, well, at least its Indian and American release. It'll release in other markets thereafter. Yeah. But um, this will be 100% non spoiler. Yeah. Because it's not out yet. And so we will not. We talk will about not talk about anything, anything that spoiler. gives anything away. Um, so not even at the end, we're uh, we, we're not going to do that just because it's not out yet, and I don't want anybody finding out about the story before they see it. So, uh, hundred percent non-spoiler review here for you can go see it in July fourth in theaters. <laughs> <laughs> Rick, your initial thoughts of Kill? Um, I was thinking about as I have been recently about medals and what I would give this one. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, platinum. Platinum? What? What does it mean, Rick? <laughs> <laughs> For those who know, you know. I have nothing else to say. Take over. <laughs> uh, this is, this, this was not just uh, as advertised as the, the, most the, 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 the most violent and goriest action film you've ever seen come out of India. It's that. Yeah. Uh, if that's your cup of tea, drink deep, my friends. Yes. Um, drink it. Swallow the gravy. Yeah. I I really hesitate to say more than that because there's a lot I'd like to say, but I feel like if I do, you won't be blessed with the benefit that we were blessed with, which is coming in with just what the trailers showed you and then letting everything else kind of surprise you. So I'm going to be really restrained. And if, for those of you who've been around and you know me, if I gave it a platinum, which is about the highest level I can give it, it's, it, it makes it one of my favorite action films of all time that has some things and aspects about it that are elevative and a couple of things that are award worthy. And I suffice it to say, I absolutely love this movie. I want very much next weekend and I'm planning to take anybody who will go with me and my family to go see it on the 4th of July because I absolutely love it. And I don't want to say anything else. I love it. <laughs> well, you have to. We have a review. Yeah. Uh, well, that, that's my review. <laughs> it's about it's about as good an action film as and you're going to see. And if it's less than 20 minutes, people will know we hate it. <laughs> <laughs> that's the thing. Anytime that we have a review that's less than 20 minutes, we're like, oh, I no. Know. I know. <laughs> Anyways. Um, yeah. As advertised. Uh, and and that, that, oh. that was a bold statement when they made it in the trailers of... The most violent action film in Indian history. And so before this, I'm pretty sure it was Rocky, the Tamil, the Tamil film Rocky. And that's a great film. You should go watch that film. Much smaller budget in, uh, in, in uh, Rocky. Um, so diff a very different style of film as well. This film is so good. Uh, and if, unless, we, could we could literally talk about this for an hour. If you're not into 
don't know if you saw Monkey Man if you're in India, obviously, because I don't know if you ever saw that, right? But if you like John Wick, if you like those style of films of, like, there's going to be, a, it's not a spoiler, a lot of kills, uh, gruesome, um, and, and that kind of thing, if you don't, if, you, if that's not really your cup of tea, then maybe, yeah, skip it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, for everything about this thing that's fantastic, if you have a weak stomach when it comes to watching violence on screen, you, you don't go. Yeah. But... I would really encourage you to get past that and remember what you're watching is is being presented to you. It's not real violence, and it is extremely cathartic in many levels, and yeah. it's it's wildly, raucously entertaining, satisfying, mm -hmm. and and, and it, yeah, I I would encourage you if you if you can. There's so much more than just the stunts and the violence. This is not just your standard. Oh, it's a it's a action flick for guys. It it really it's a lot more than and that. And they they it, I'm not going to give anything away, but they don't waste any time in getting the film going. There's never uh, a dull moment. There it's you know um, some films have a, a, a really long setup. And that's not what this film is about. This film is about full throttle in your face, and, and it's it's absolutely glorious. But it's not just mindless either. No. So it's it's not just like this is the only thing we're going in for right now. We're all, it, it, you have story behind it, and you have um, <laughs> this gentleman has no idea why there's two guys in a car talking in a microphone. You got a problem? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, there's a, there's an actual story behind it, um, as well as. More than Hollywood, it almost seems condescending to say Hollywood level action in this film. Um, uh, and, I, 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 and the reason I say that is because I'm like, the India has been there for, for a the, while, but not with this genre. No, and, and this is the kind of action that doesn't defy physics. And this is the kind of action that when you're watching it, if this was a Hollywood film, this would be another film I would be pounding the pavement and saying over and over again, when are we going to give Oscars to stunt work? Yeah. This is that level of stunt choreography. And what Corbin was just saying a second ago as well, the, the, the got to say it without giving anything away, but story, the story, the writing, the script, and the casting. I'm telling you, <laughs> it's really, really good. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a fun ride. And it's it's one. It's short. It's like an hour fifty something. I think. Yeah, it's it just under two hours. So, it, it, in a lot of ways, it feels very Indian. So, it, it is, I'm not. Uh, we talked to the director because we had the pleasure of talking. And the uh, producer, uh, one uh, of the producers, producer, uh, uh, Gunit. Yeah, uh, Oscar Kapoor winning from the producer, Lunchbox, and then uh, Jack, 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 Elephant Elvis Whispers. Whispers. Yeah, uh, she she really likes producing content. Um, she, and we spoke with, and you said director, we spoke with our the director, yeah. the director, um, and. I was telling him, I was like, this feels like an Indian film in terms of obviously all the actors and it feels the, the, the story central and it's Indian and all that stuff. But the 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 type of film it is didn't feel like I was watching an Indian movie that I'm used to of the what well, we're going on almost 500 films. Right. Currently. Right. I had not seen this, an Indian film like this. This is this is absolutely a wonderfully put together film that maintains its Indian DNA and it is an Indian film and is an international film because the level of excellence and I, I can't my I'm really really hoping that this thing just explodes I mean if if the world can get behind Hakatua right now <laughs> uh, they can get behind this question because I know my answer did you like this as much less than or more than Monkey Man uh that's tough. Different films. They're very, um, very different films. Similar in, in aspects of obviously very similar in aspects. Violent, gruesome action. Yeah, but that Monkey Man for me is certified gold. Yeah, I, I, I love Monkey Man. Yeah, but if if someone told me I have to choose which of these two films I get to watch again for the rest of my life, I would miss Monkey Man. Yeah, that's how much I like this one. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, and I, I, like I cannot them both. wait to watch this. With Micah and Alexis and Ashley and Harrell and and Andrani, it was if they if they will go because I know that they're gonna love it. It was super interesting because we got sent uh, to the it was a Lionsgate premiere, right? Um, and I thought it was gonna be kind of like the Monkey Man premiere where they, they right. had of actually, um, we were like a couple of the only white people there. It was a bunch of Indian influencers at but, at, at Monkey Man, yeah, like NRI right. Indian influencers from here in America, right? 
Uh, and so they would all had been familiar with Indian films right. and, and stuff like that. So I thought it was going to be very similar. But it was actually predominantly outside of, I think I saw a few Indians. Because it was Letterbox. Yeah. This was, was this was, was a Letterbox, letterbox premiere. Skate kind of thing. Right. Uh, so it was probably a lot of Letterbox people. And it, so, for example, to show you, there were how many people you think were in there probably? Maybe 50, 50 plus. Yeah, right? 50 plus. There were probably about 50 people. And when they introduced them, uh, the director and the producer, and, and, and she mentioned that she she produced the lunchbox three people <laughs> applauded and two of the three were Corbin and I that's how unfamiliar i think yeah. a lot of these folks are with indian cinema yeah uh, and so it was interesting why cuz normally we're the two we're the, 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 the right the, the ones who the know foreigners less. watching this indian film <laughs> right. with a group of indians <laughs> you, if there's people said, in the theater you said to me at one point I said i think we're more indian than most everybody in here <laughs> exactly <laughs> uh, and so it was interesting and they were all really enjoying oh. it uh, and, and and along for the ride and obviously everybody Laughing. in there is probably very familiar with american films and Probably not with Indian films, but they were enjoying it just like an American film. So many spots of action where you are howling and clapping your hands because it's just so outrageous and so satisfying. And the whole audience did that. How much that that occurred at least 10 or 12 oh, yeah, times yeah, yeah, yeah. throughout the film where something was just so spectacular. Everybody's laughing and clapping their hands. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Um, and there was surprises yeah. in it in terms of like stuff that you're like, whoa, that happened. And, and a really important thing about this, uh, I w wish we had been able to tell them as well. I have so much that I could talk to them for like 45 minutes as should director be and the an, producer. Should be an interesting podcast. Um, host, host. The, 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 I was, it was so good at the halfway point. I thought, okay, it's really difficult to maintain a first half the way you did. And, and keep this going and not lose track of yourself and like go off the rails. You've got a great story. You've got great acting. You've got great action. Are you going to stay true to that and see it all the way through? Or did you only have something of a story in and this was really just the marketing for it being? And man, oh man, did it just stay the course. Yeah, there's one element that I, I would have preferred not be in there. And it's a small thing. And uh, I don't really want to give anything away, but it, it has to do with... Uh, it's a flashback. Um, well, you don't like flashbacks. Yeah, I'm not anyway. a big. I'm not a big person. And there's not like it's. I know what you're talking not, about. I like it. It's not a big thing in the film. Uh, I like it. That's just an element that it's never my cup of tea. Yeah. I don't need it. I know what's going on already in this. Yeah, if, if I know. Yeah, you do. Without spoilers, there's no. You wouldn't. You wouldn't. There's a couple of things. There's. There's two. Ah, spoilers. Well, spoilers. Can't. We can't yeah, tell you. you. Can't. But uh, but there's one in, but there's one moment in particular you you couldn't you couldn't. I disagree. Uh, uh, well, when we're done, we'll talk. I about disagree. It. Um, but that's the small only nitpick that I have with the film for my personal taste is just you guys. If you've been around, yeah, while, I, you know my like. I got anytime none. An, a film ends and it's like two years later, I'm like, oh, good lord, we're <laughs> are we gonna mess up the film now. Not that that happened. No, in whatever. If they if the audio is bad, I'm sorry. Go see it. Um, but yeah, it's it was a it was a fun ride. Uh, it was a, it was, it was such an interesting um, um, juxtaposition from what we saw yesterday because we came off Kolke yesterday. Mm. Not comparing, you can't compare the two because there's yeah, completely totally different, different style films. of films. But uh, in terms of how complex that story was, in terms of how many parts there had going on, and almost how simple this story was, uh, yeah. it, it, for the most part, right? It was it was very straightforward. Pretty straightforward Needs story. Needs to be, yeah. Uh, even though there are complexities, but but and but, I was grateful that there were some aspects where I did get a shock. Yes. Oh, yeah. There were a couple yeah. things where I went, "Oh, dang, they did that." Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it happened. They're not uh, messing around. Quite a few times. Yeah. It was such a joy to see because normally, when we've watched Indian, like I said, we've seen almost four, uh, almost five hundred, almost five hundred now. Uh, and so you can kind of guess what they're going to show sometimes, what they're going to do sometimes. Right. Especially if, like, if it's Hindi, you're like, okay, this is going to be Bollywood. You you know what they're... They're right. going to go more family-friendly a lot of times. It is not the family-friendly movie you want to go see. Uh, interesting fact that we got told uh, by the producer. You're going to see the exact same version that we saw. Yeah. In India. In India. The censor board did not cut anything. America... <laughs> Required them to cut stuff if they, they didn't. Do. They were about to give them an in. And cause, see, yeah, yeah, because we don't have a censor board, so they're not going to be like, you can't play this. They're going to give you a higher rating. They were going to give them an NC17 rating 
and they the made violence. Him cut a few things yeah, they to make to cut it two R. scenes to, to to appease the the Which motion picture association. I still hate. Yeah, but they, they <laughs> and they have to do that because you you just you kill <laughs> pun intended the box office if you make a film NC seventeen. You know, no one's gonna see it yes. because they just it's you, it's the rating is just too prohibitive. So they did change a couple things, uh, but she we were told it's you're gonna see it exactly the way we're seeing it here. Yeah, which is which, which is great. Is absolutely fantastic. Please, that's, please uh, do see it. That's please a concern support it. Concern that we had for sure. And by the way, uh, I had said earlier, acting is uniformly wonderful. It is. Yes. Everybody, you have a couple of people who are the predominant leads, mm. and most especially Laksha. Laksha. Um, and then uh, it, the they, great thing you have about him is he's a absolutely believable hero in every respect. Simultaneously, he is clearly a competent actor. So you have somebody who has a, a funny dancer. We know that. Yeah, you, you got. Well, that was the other one. Oh yes. Yeah. yeah. Um, but you've got you've got somebody who's who's got the capacity to be a, a, a superstar because he has the physicality to pull off everything believably as this hero. There's not a moment I don't believe that he can do the things he's doing and he's doing them. But then he's also, as the film progresses, you see the emotional depth that he has as an actor. So, fantastic choice. And uh, Raghav jo Jual oh, yeah, as well. Of so you guys know him. Uh, you know him as the dancer funny guy, apparently. Um, he did a fantastic job as the uh, antagonist yeah. in, in this movie. And, 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 and Tanya, uh, Tanya Maniktala well, did a very good job. Right at the get-go. The there were no minute, weak links. The minute that she's she's early in the film, one of the first people that appears on in the film, when you get established in the cast, you get a feeling for what things are like. And my first thought within 60 seconds was, awesome, she's going to be fantastic. And, and Rick she is, is throughout. positive she's Bengali I'm because positive, of her 100%. eyes. Even though she was born in Delhi, I know that. <laughs> But if there's no Bengali blood in there, I will eat my shoes. <laughs> I'd be very surprised. <laughs> Anyways, if you've seen it, let us know what you thought of it. No spoilers. Obviously, no spoilers. No in the spoilers. Comments. We don't please, want to give the spoilers away please, from anybody. Please, if you've seen it. If, uh, if you're waiting for it, obviously it comes out on July 4th uh, everywhere. Um, please go watch it. Oh, I can't uh, hope and this and thing let us know explodes. what you think about it. Um, and, uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> On to the next movie review. On to the next movie <laughs> review. Uh, that seems like a weird way to. <gasps>